All right, guys. So a while back, I showed you some tutorials with interrupt tools, uh, a tool that allows you to change some system settings. And when enable this this tool, interrupt tools, when enabling it on, you can't really disable it off uh, because uh, you can't really change some system settings without with this option off. So you kind of have to turn it on to change those settings and some people run some problems um, not being able to download updates from the store or uh, even updating the OS itself well because you have this option on and you can't really turn it off and the only way to turn it off is to make a hard reset of course but today I'm gonna show you how to turn it off and by that way everything should kind of be fixed kind of uh, so let's go back, uh, let's go into a registry browser, uh, then local machine, then software, OEM, Nokia, uh, Nokia SVC host, plugins, uh, NSGXTA, not B but A, there was B, uh, and NTDSK SVC then go into path and here at the bottom registry value data this is different uh, we need to change it to the default so delete this everything delete everything change the default path which was previously so let's uh, introduce it So make sure you write it just like I, I write it with capital letters, with small letters, with underscore, with points, with everything how I, I write it. I'm gonna also leave it in the description how it's, how you should type it. Uh, but make sure you type it like this, then press write and if you go again in path, it should be this path already. Uh, let's just type right again. Let's go back and if you go now into interrupt tools, then it was Disabled now you can enable it of course and it will change that path again, but it got disabled uh, Now to make full effect Restart your phone and after the phone is restarted Everything kind of should be fixed. So by this trick uh, It's you should now be able to install updates from the store and also update your OS without making a hard reset but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this trick was useful. Like I said in the previous video on the on the tutorial for interrupt tools, uh, try it at, at your own risk, of course, uh, because I knew there could be some uh, effects, some side effects, which there was some side effects. But uh, with this trick, hopefully we can you can fix it. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Tell me where they